What is up, y'all? Welcome to a morning routine with a newborn as a first time mom. So I made sure to wake up early today because I needed to get some alone time, okay? I cannot stress how important it is having those first moments alone, if it's possible, in a quiet place. Because the first thing I do when I get up is go to God, okay? I have to have some quiet, I have to have some peace, and I need something to fill me up before I start pouring into others. I've been reading the book, When Women Pray by Bishop T.D. Jakes, and it is so impactful. It talks about the power that women hold when they pray and what happens when women come together and pray. Thank you, Homery, for sending me this beautiful table. Homery is an online furniture store where you can find everything you need for your home. Today, they sent me the Nest Nassis Round Wood Lift Top Nesting Coffee Table. I always get asked where I got my coffee table, and it's Homery. I love that this coffee table is round, especially because I have a little one, and when she starts to walk, I don't want to have any sharp corners or edges that may hurt her. I also love the storage on this. Oh my gosh, what? Yes, it has so much storage, and you can even lift the top of the black piece it's amazing like what and these are also not connected they are separate so if you want to put the black one somewhere and the white one in another place you definitely can do that homery will have a lot of amazing products during their christmas sale from december 23rd to the 27th you can get up to 90 percent off so do not hesitate and shop on homery today Okay, girl, time to get into this morning routine. So first, I'm just washing my hands because I'm about to prepare baby girl's bottle. She's still sleeping right now, thank the Lord, but I knew she was about to wake up. So we use the Philip Avent bottles. They really helped with her gas. When she was a newborn newborn, she had a lot of gas and a lot of like bubbles in her stomach when she would drink from her bottle. So we switched to the Philip Avent and bomb. 10 out of 10, recommend. So I got about eight ounces total from this pump session and I just ended up putting four into her bottle. She usually drinks about four to four and a half ounces per feeding. And she's probably feeding every like four hours, four and a half hours. So my sis is doing good. So she was crying and wanted to get up. So here comes the mama to the rescue. I love motherhood. I know that like sometimes people be hating on motherhood, but listen, if you a mama, be proud to be a mother. Motherhood is such a beautiful, trying, frustrating, exciting journey. Like there's so many emotions that connect to motherhood, but this was a morning that was super slow. I was able to take my time and those are my favorite type of mornings, you know? So what we do in our household is I take the morning shift. My husband usually does the night shift, so I'm able to wake up energized and really tackle the day. I'm gonna go ahead and change baby girl's diaper. She's looking so cute. So we are using the Pamper Pears. I've talked about this before on my channel, but we tried Huggies zero out of 10 recommend pamper pure is definitely our bomb and then also the pamper pure wipes we just keep it consistent over here i think in my last morning routine i was trying out the products from the wade's line and i really like them but i ended up just sticking with pamper pure because it's honestly what was at target and i found it right away so <laughs> i went ahead and changed her diaper she is so cute and we're going to head upstairs so we can do a little bit of interactive time so i can read to her and all that fun stuff Okay, one of my favorite parts of motherhood is this right here. The skin to skin, spending time with my baby. I'm actually reading her a Lulla Bible. This is a Lulla Bible, y'all. They literally have a Bible for babies. 10 out of 10. So cute. But I love to just take my time in the morning with her if I can and do a lot of skin to skin because since I pump and I don't actually nurse, this skin to skin is so important for me to stay connected to my baby and it's so good for the mom 
and the baby. So make sure you're doing a lot of skin to skin, especially in the newborn phase. So I went in her closet because I wanted to pick her out something cute to wear. If we're just gonna be in the house, I'm definitely just gonna put her in a long onesie and call it a day. So I picked out this cute little yellow one. By the way, she looks so freaking cute in yellow. Like my girl just be doing it. So I'm gonna put her onesie on her. But after this, I do wanna show you guys some of the interactive toys that I use with her because she is three and a half months old. I know sometimes it's like, what do I do? She can't walk, she can't talk. What do I do to keep her entertained? And I'm gonna show you some of the things I do. But side note, she did not wanna do any tummy time this morning. She was very, very fussy. So I said, okay, girl, I'll just lay you down on your mat and just let you look at your little toys. So this is something that I like to do just to keep her entertained. So it works her brain muscle. She's able to look at different shapes and colors and things that are dangling above her head. Sometimes she reaches for them. So I have a whole bunch of little toys where she can hold and she's starting to grab things this is really great she can just shake it around and really get her hand eye coordination on point she is growing so fast y'all it's crazy i also do her 100 word book basically i'll just sit with her i'll point at pictures i'll say the word over and over again and then she's also got these patterns that she can look at so just little interactive stuff to keep her busy so she's not laying on her back all day long because i know they're at that awkward stage where it's like what do i do but there are little things that you can do so i just have a whole bunch of little toys the mirror is great for tummy time if you put it ahead of them so they can look at theirself and this was great when she was a newborn newborn like one to two months and basically it just has patterns the black and white contrast is really good for newborns and just gets them curious gets them looking all of that type of stuff so i'm doing i'm doing my baby's hair it had to get done her hair is so long y'all like she, she 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 got inches okay she definitely has inches inches so I am doing something that's low tension this is this has no tension on her hair it is not tight it's not pulling out her hair none of that you all none of that it's literally just a little bow I don't use any rubber bands or anything like that and as y'all can see she was trying to munch on her toy she's starting to teeth so pray for me but now it's time to go ahead and exchange her off to her daddy oh Yes, I love that my husband works from home as well because we definitely take shifts throughout the day. But look at how cute she is, y'all. Like her little bow. Oh my gosh, I love my baby so much. So I went ahead and I handed her off to her dad so I can have some much needed me time. Okay, so I'm going ahead and taking a shower. Showers? Listen, something about a shower just resets your whole life, makes me feel refreshed and ready to take on my day. Having you time, alone time as a mother is so important. I know sometimes it feels like we're being selfish, but you deserve that. As much as you do for others, you need to also do for yourself. So I make sure to prioritize myself as well in the morning and clean my body, feel refreshed. Sometimes I pray in the shower if I wasn't able to in the morning and really just set my intentions for the day. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you so much. I appreciate you so much. Make sure to tune in for more content like this and I will see you next video.